Hey guys, it's Ropsy, back with Paperless Humans. Welcome to episode 6 of this free course for Apple Notes on the iPad. Make sure you subscribe for free courses on different apps. When adding photos to your notes in Apple Notes, you can either add one from your photos library by going to the camera icon and going to choose photo or video. You can also drag and drop the photo from any app. Or you can take a photo with your iPad camera. You can retake photos you don't like. Images have different options depending on where you place them. You can add them either to the body text or your handwritten notes. Body text images go above or below your text in a block of their own. Long pressing the image gives you options to display small images or large images. This affects all the images in your notes, not just the one you make changes on. Tapping an image opens it in a separate window for markup where you can annotate the image with handwriting tools or you can add a description under the plus icon on the toolbar you can also add text Signature, and Shapes. Tap Done to save the changes and exit the markup window. Apple Notes has a tendency of adding photos to body text away from your handwriting. You can simply drag it to the handwritten section. Long press to lift the image off the page and then move it to your handwritten notes. To ensure your images go to the handwritten section, drag and drop them over some written notes. Then move them afterwards. Handwritten notes can mix with your image. And this section supports PNG images, which are images without a background. You can resize and rotate your images. For videos, you can record them in the app or add one from your photos library. All your videos go to body text. They don't mix with anything else. You can play the video in full screen You're also able to rewind or fast forward 10 seconds at a time. You can adjust the playback speed when in full screen mode 
you can stop your video to extract any text or handwriting from the screen using live text. Simply tap the live text icon at the bottom of the video for the app to highlight all the notes in your video. You can then select some sections of your highlighted text to copy for pasting in your notes. You can also translate, which will focus on any different video. You can also look up the meaning of words. or search the word to Google the word on the internet. That is all for your photos and videos in Apple Notes. Thank you for watching. See you in the next episode.